Next up is the Valiant. There's the 109. Just as it was coming in for final approach, he got shot down. I stalled it. Man, I'm not that worried about the fuse up top, but the bottom looks a little tweaked. But I don't know. But I'm sure the landing gear. Something's got to be wrong with the landing gear. But, oh well. I had no business flying it that far away, trying to turn it. Just no business whatsoever. I so much wanted to grease a landing. I felt greasy. Instead of a little grease, I created a little goulash. A little goulash! I don't know. 28th has not always been a lucky day. It's my birthday. But back when I was in high school, I got a ticket. October 28th. It was a speed trap. Time remaining, seven minutes. Going downhill where it switches, down a pretty steep hill where it switched from 45 to 35, right in the middle of the hill. And then on October 28th, I got a ticket. Driving on the country road going home. The speed limit on the road was 35. I was going 35. And the officer insisted it was 25 and gave me a ticket that I could not beat. <sighs> then another one of my homie town police gave me a ticket saying that I went through a red light. I was in a string of cars and it turned yellow. I couldn't have stopped. Uh, to this day, I couldn't have stopped. But that put me three tickets. Three tickets in a 90-day window. I had to go talk to a guy who had no sympathy. He's like, why should I let you keep your license? And what did I learn from that lesson? Is that if you have any doubt that it's an unfair ticket, you fight it. And I fought every, I didn't get that many tickets after that, but I fought them all. In the Army there, we were in the South Station at Fort Lee. It was a Sunday and a buddy in the barracks wanted me to give him a ride out. He needed, I don't know, something from a radio shack. So we had to go out to Colonial Heights, Virginia on a Sunday, thinking that there would be a radio shack. There's nothing open in Colonial Heights on a Sunday, except for churches. And we pulled out of the, I was driving a Nova, 78 Nova, it had a mag wheel, it was a nice looking car. I pulled out and I didn't do anything crazy, I just, we just pulled out and he pulled me over. Said I made an illegal lane change, which I, to this day I don't understand how he got that. We joked. Uh, I said we we always joked about that ticket. I went and the, and the judge just dismissed it. I still say it was a ticket for driving with a black friend <laughs> in Colonial Heights, Virginia, on a Sunday. <laughs> We always laughed about that ticket though, that was hilarious. Oh well. I was gonna bring the decathlon out today. Now that's a plane that I'm tired of. I mean, I like the way it flies, but it, anything that the Decathlon can do, 
like the Valiant can do or the Tundra and they just take the Decathlon just takes up so it takes up two racks in the garage because it's so big but I don't really want to destroy it because I have a nice motor in it but I envision setting up cameras and slamming it into the ground that I don't really want to destroy. It's got one of those uh, Value Hobby 46 size motors in it that's perfect. I mean it's a perfect motor man. It's so nice. This breeze is perfect for just floating around and messing around. I should have brought the Mamba out today. Starting to get hot. Of course, after our airplane recovery mission. I just love the little split us. Look, this plane is such a fun plane to fly. That's why, I mean, yeah, I was doing, a, I had a lot of rudder in that turn. I didn't have speed, and with the green and the glare of the sun, I just, I lost orientation. The last time I saw orientation, I was upside down, going slow, heading towards the turf. About that high, if lower than that even. I don't know, I had no business flying that low back there in that corner. It's a lot windier back there in the corner. Oh well. I don't feel sad or mad or anything or glad that I crashed it. But heck, nobody got hurt. Nobody died. Tuco didn't even get a sand burr. Not enough wind to really surf it in. I'm gonna have to land at some speed. Yeah. I gave myself more throw after the rebuild from the banner thing. So I can got just a little bit more throws. I didn't get more throws on the elevators, but I did on the uh, I mean on the ailerons. I did on the elevator and the rudder. I gave myself more throw. Oh, yeah, it's better. And I don't have that many warbirds. I got rid of most of them. I really like that 109. Hopefully I can get it back going. I pulled up on the elevator. That's 